go. The yellow board goes across. Green flag. Pro 2 is headed towards Forest County. Potawatomi turn number... It'll be Mickey Thomas, Corey Winter side by side through turn one, leading the field down into turn two, then it's Jared Brooks. Look at Corey Winter, he had a win this weekend. And here goes Mickey Thomas on the outside, flying off the flyaway. Well, the Pro Fours are already underway. Not a very big head start for our Pro Twos. The big dogs are coming into turn one now. CJ Greaves will take that top spot in Pro Four. The Pro Twos are already at the finish line. Look at Greaves now. Kyle Leduc trying to hunt down CJ Greaves in that 33. Yeah, Johnny Greaves fell back a couple spots. Oh, you look see? at the rain really coming down. Corey Winter just tiptoeing his way. It is going to get greasy out there very fast for our Pro 2s. Our Pro 4s are already starting to pick off the tail end of the Pro 2s. We'll yeah. see how long Brand can hold off CJ Greaves. Brand got a pretty good run there. This is not helping the Pro 4s whatsoever. No, absolutely. I mean, they're playing fair, but at the same time, it don't take much. Look at that. Mickey Thomas sliding right up against the berm. Now here comes Kyle Duke back to the inside of CJ Greaves trying to make that pass stick. Kyle Duke. Vendors again. That rain's still coming down, Shane. So these Pro Fours, they love it. But Kyle Duke trying to wiggle his way around, almost stubs the truck. He didn't want to get in the back of CJ Greaves. And now they have caught a pack of Pro Twos. Things are about to get interesting for the Pro Four leaders. It is really stacked up against the Pro Twos right now. It is Thomas out front, Brooks in second. And then it's the Pro Fours. CJ Greaves, Kyle LaDuke working their way around. Kyle climbing. Yeah, Kyle LaDuke really trying to be patient as we're coming to six laps to go this time by. And look at the rain still. We keep saying it because it's rain on our camera. It is creating very, very bad issues for the Pro Twos because the exit speed on the corners, they can't find grip. As you see, there's Thomas, there's Brooks. And then the two lead Pro 4s, CJ Greaves, Kyle Duke, trying to hook them down as they come down the steel and straight away. Wow, look at CJ Greaves just hucking it into the gravel pit, trying to get it to rotate. You see that exit speed right there on Brooks. Yeah, that Brooks. Pro 4, watch out, Greaves is coming. Brooks was trying to lean on CJ Greaves and maybe push him off the race line a little bit, but he was trying in vain. Greaves had the run. And now it's a matter of time before Greaves gets the run on Mickey Thomas. Well, right here, Shane, this is where it's going to happen. He goes really, really wide in the loamy dirt, but that Pro 4 will pull ahead. Two-wheel drive in these conditions is not going to cut it. Now CJ we'll Greaves, the new race leader, and he still has two Pro 2s between himself and Kyle LaDuke. Five laps to go here in the Forest County Potawatomi Cup. The Pro 4s are dominating this race. Yeah, just as you were saying that, Brent, Johnny Greaves was finally able to get around Mickey Thomas, so the top three trucks on the racetrack now are all Pro 4s. I said I was gonna keep an eye on the interval. It stayed right about at five seconds, so at this point, Kyle LaDuke not really gaining any ground on CJ Greaves whatsoever. One corner to go. He is a three-time Crandon World Cup champion. He gets to add a new trophy to the collection today. His first Forest County Potawatomi Cup race win, CJ Greaves. 